Hello everyone and welcome back to Stardew Valley. My name's Tuck Gorsa and it's now week two. Let's go outside and see if there's anything waiting for us. Oops, this is a WASD game. <laughs> um, hi Clint. Uh, hi. Good morning. I noticed that you've been breaking some rocks open and finding ore. That's good. Okay, get to the point. If you want to get the most out of the ores you find, you'll need a furnace. Just so happens I had an extra set of blueprints lying around here. I want you to have them. I didn't get blueprints! I learned how to craft a furnace. Um, thank you, Clint. <laughs> the furnace allows you to smelt metal bars. The bars can be used for crafting, construction, and tool upgrades. When you smelt a few copper bars, consider having me upgrade one of your tools. It can make your work a lot easier. Well, okay, I'm heading home. Take it easy. New journal entry. Forging ahead. If you're gonna keep mining, you should build a furnace. Um, yeah, I'll get to that in a little bit. First, we've got mail. I see you've been exploring the old mine. You've got the adventurer spirit, that much I can tell. If you slay 10 slimes, you'll have earned your place in my adventurer's guild. Be careful, Marlin. Okay. And we've also got that as a quest now. Initiation. 10 slime slime. Okay. Well, I'm gonna do my morning routine. Let me grab my watering can. Alright, well if you didn't notice earlier, we had some parsnips over here as um, the wild seeds. So that's good. Now, let's see, it's 7.30. Um, I'm gonna go see if I can go find Penny and deliver her the topaz. Uh oh. Um, what's going on, Mayor Lewis? Oh, howdy. Well, oh, nice or. This is the Pelican Town Community Center, or what's left of it, anyhow. It used to be the pride and joy of the town, always bustling with activity. Now just look at it. It's shameful. These days, young folk would rather just sit in front of the TV than engage with anybody else. But you listen to me. I sound like an old fool. Joja Corporation has been hounding me to sell them the land so they can turn it into a warehouse. Pelican Town could use the money, but there's something stopping me from selling it. I guess old timers like me get attached to relics of the past. Ah, well. If anyone else buys a Joja Co. membership, I'm going to go ahead and sell it. Here, let's go inside. Hmm, what's well, Stace? <laughs> that came out bad. I guess Vincent and Jass must have been playing in here. This place is even more of a mess than I remember. How the hell am I supposed to say dilapidated? 
Well, I guess I just did. <laughs> What? Well, it's gone now. It was just right there. What's the matter? You sick? It was right there, I swear. I swear it was right there. Huh, you saw something. I wouldn't be surprised if this place was full of rats. It's right there! Turn her God! You're worrying me. Look, I think I'm gonna head home. I need some lunch. Yeah, go ahead. Leave me in the creepy old house. Hey, I'll keep this place unlocked from now on. Maybe you can catch the rat if you have some extra time. I don't want to catch the rat. That wasn't a rat. <laughs> Strange. I'll have to come back and explore this building further. Well, you don't have to tell me that. I was already thinking it. Penny! Penny! Stop. Hey, you brought me the item I asked for. Thanks so much. You are very welcome, Penny. Here's a little something for your trouble. Yay. 240 gold. Yeah, I'll investigate that later. Hi, Gunther. I've got a couple of more things for you. I've got an amnestice and an earth crystal for you. Oh, I got a reward. What do you have for me? Cauliflower seeds? Heck yeah. I'll go plant those. There we go. Okay, now let's go see if we can find anything else. I might spend the rest of the day in the mines. Hi, Haley. Would you like a flower? Mmm, too bad. It's not yours. <laughs> I'm so mean. Oh, if you saw my intro video, episode zero, you saw that my other character was married to Haley. I don't like her that much. I always preferred her sister, Emily. Thank you. I'm feeling a positive energy from this gift. You're very welcome, Emily. I'll see you sometime later, maybe. But if I want to have somebody to take to the dance, I still have to woo Haley. Birds! Rah! <laughs> ooh, 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 ooh. Um, buy seeds. An ornamental fan, yes! <laughs> ooh, Gunther's gonna be so proud of us. Let's go give it to him. Um, let's put it down there. All right, so I'm going to go drop off stuff at my house, and then we're going to head over to the mines. Nope, no minerals. And I don't really want stone that bad, so... Let's go down. Immediately, copper! Come on, poke your head back out. Stupid thing. Let me dig in peace. All right, going down. Let's see, we can only be down here for about another hour or so. Those are my two objectives. Mining copper and killing slimes. Okay, I'll take that. Let's see if we can get down to floor 10. I'm exhausted. I can't go any further. We're done. All right. And that's the end of day eight. Yeah, not much gold, but... Morning of day nine. Oh, no. Oh, no, don't take the TV. There's nothing going on. Ooh, yay! We've got parsnips. 
Okay, and we need to water everything else. Alright, and we also had another parsnip on that side. It was actually a silver parsnip. Good morning, Pierre. Can you give me some parsnip seeds? 15 if you wouldn't mind. Thank you very much. Have a good one, Pierre. Good morning, Clint. I've got a couple of geodes that I'd like you to crack open for me. Yes, stone. Alright. Thank you, Clint. Let's go stop by Gunther's. Morning, Gunther. I got a couple of things to donate to the cause. Two different gems. Imagine that. Alright. Thank you, Gunther. Or I should be saying, you're welcome, Gunther. Ah. Hi, Jas. Hi, Vincent. Let's see. What did we end up donating? Alamite. Its distinctive fluorescence makes a favorite among rock collectors. I can see why. And quartz. A clear crystal commonly found in caves and mines. AKA not very special. Alright, um. Let's go find Haley and pawn off a daffodil for her. Or not for her, to her. Wait, wait where's Willie heading? Let's follow him. Ooh, did he see us? Um, I'm just peeking in Mayor Lewis's house, don't worry. Okay, he's just, he's just going in for a checkup. Now Haley's gonna either be up here or still at home. So, still at home. Oh! Good morning, Haley. Here you go. For me? Thank you. You're welcome, Haley. Okay, and let's plant my parsnips. There we go. Hey, look, my spring onions are back. Again. Awesome. Oh, and I got two gold ones so far. Nice. Well, I guess it's not the same patch. Whatever, I got more spring onions. I'm fine with that. Hi, Leah. Um, do you like dandelions? She can have the dandelion. Here you go, Leah. This is a really nice gift. Thank you. You are most welcome, Leah. Oh, I can't read that. Hey, hey, little creature thing, you're gonna have to help me out. I can't, I can't read this. Okay, so it's still early enough in the day. Let's see if I can actually hit level 10 this time. There we go. There we go, there's my way down. Oop. Ooh, I got crabs. Or a crab and a cherry bomb. Okay, okay, wait, there's a way down. Yes! Da 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 da! Leather boots. Hey, I'll take what I can get. Um, let me throw. What, the wood on the floor? And then I can put these on my feet. Now I've got leather boots. Nice. 
Well, then I have to go talk to Marlin because we now have the Adventurer's Guild Sealed of Approval. Okay, what do I need to do to make a furnace? 20 copper ore for a furnace? Man, that's half of my copper. I need it though, so... Okay, it's the end of day nine. Oh, we had a pretty mighty haul from farming today. Look at all those parsnips. Totally worth it. Eh, everything else is kind of meh, but 897 gold, that's pretty good. But now, it's the 10th of spring, year one. Okay, today is Vincent's birthday. Oh, I need to get him a birthday gift. What did little boys in this game like? I have no idea. Oh, hi, Marnie. Hello, Techwar. You see this cat here? I, I see the cat. I found it sitting outside the entrance to your farm. I think it's a stray, poor little thing. It's well behaved for a stray. I think it likes this place. Hey, um, don't you think this is a farm could use a good cat? I suppose it could. Yes, I will adopt the cat. Um. Oh man, I don't have any good cat names. Not, not, not like right off the bat like this. Um. Okay, I found a good name. I'll call her Laurel. Well, little Laurel, you be a good kitty now, okay? Well, that was the most difficult task I've ever been tasked with. All right, so we also have mail. This is a busy morning so far. My sources tell me you've been poking around inside the old community center. Why don't you pay me a visit? My chambers are west of the forest lake in the stone tower. I may have information concerning your rat problem. Immerasmodius wizard. Well, I don't have time for wizards. I've got crops to water. And a kitty bowl to fill. Oh, let me pick crops first, I guess. What is this? Potatoes! Awesome. Now, let me water. There we go. Knock, knock. Ah, yes! Come in! I am Rasmodius, seeker of the arcane truths. Mediator between physical and ethereal. Master of the seven elementals. Keeper of the sacred chain. You get the point. And you, the one whose arrival I have long foreseen. I'd like to show you something. Behold! Hey, it's one of the Junimos. No, don't keep it trapped. You're mean. Stop it. You've seen one of these before, haven't you? Please let it go. You're hurting it. They call themselves the Junimos. Mysterious spirits. These ones, for some reason, they refuse to speak with me. That's because you have it trapped. 
I'm not sure why they've moved into the community center, but you have no reason to fear them. Hmm. You found a golden scroll written in an unknown language? Most interesting. Stay here. I'm going to see for myself. I'll return shortly. Bye bye. Hey, you could have teleported back in. And geez, I found the newt. The language is obscure, but I was able to decipher it. We, the Junimo, are happy to aid you. In return, we. Oh, wait, I don't have to read this in his voice. <laughs> we, the Junimo, are happy to aid you. In return, we ask for gifts of the valley. If you are one with the forest, then you will see the true nature of the scroll. Hmm. One with the forest. What do they mean? That probably just sounds so wrong to you guys. Um, sniff, sniff. Sniff, sniff. Aha! Come here. My cauldron is bubbling with ingredients from the forest. Baby fern, moss scrub, caramel top. Tune stool, can you smell it? Ugh. Here, drink up. Let the essence of the force permeate your body. Do I have to? Okay, glug, glug, glug. Oh, oh, I'm gonna be sick. Oh, oh no. Oh, why were you even making... Oh, God. Oh, God, the trees. They're coming after me. The trees are gonna eat me. Oh, God. Oh, the trees. Don't let them get me. Rasmodius, don't let them get me. You've gained the power of forest magic. Now you can decipher the true meaning of the Junimo scrolls. Oh. Oh. So, if a wizard tells you to drink something from his bubbling cauldron, just say no. I'm gonna go vomit now. Let's see if we can go find Vincent now. Maybe he'll like the horseradish. I don't know. Hi, Vincent. Happy birthday. <laughs> I don't think he liked that. Oh, look at that sad face. I'm sorry, kid, I didn't have anything to give you. Oh, so, um, speaking of Vincent, wild horseradish is the thing he absolutely hates. I gave him the worst thing possible. Okay, so we can finish. I want to put these in order. So, a horseradish, daffodil, a leek, and a dandelion. A dandelion. <laughs> awesome. Now, what do we get as a reward? 30 spring seeds. Well, I've got to rush home and plant those. And then, let's see, the exotic bundle. I'm just going to throw these in there. The moral and the cave carrot. Now, I just need three more and I'll finish this bundle. Oh, we also unlocked up there. And, oh, since we completed one, we get two more? 
Okay, let's see what those require. This looks like a storeroom. Spring crops need to parsnip, a green bean, a cauliflower, and a potato. Oh, I regret selling those potatoes now. All right, we'll get another parsnip before the end of the month. We'll get cauliflower in a couple of days, but green beans and potatoes. Oh, I've got to go grab um, those seedlings from Pierre's. Oh, no, he's closed on Wednesdays. Ah, no. No, that's fine. We'll just pick it up in the morning. All of it should grow before the end of the month. Because there's 28 days in the month. Okay. All right, so I've got 30 seeds to plant. Well, let's get to it. Okay. All right. And now it's the end of day 10. Sleep for the night? Yes. Oh, yay. I was just talking about those. We can make the tappers now. Yeah, I kind of regret selling those potatoes now. Whatever, we'll buy more seeds tomorrow. We'll figure out what we need to buy and we'll buy it. 